All right, hey there guys, I guess it's letting me record. Just wanted to put up a, a little video um, to be on the lookout for this certain kind of doll. Um, she's called My Twin, kind of like the American Girl dolls. And they're 23 inch tall, like posable uh, little girl dolls. And you can, uh, at the time, I don't know if the company's still around, but at the time you could um, order a doll to look like your your little girl, you know, different, you know, blonde hair, brown hair, red hair, you know, tan skin, light skin, different colored eyes, and they're bendable and poseable, and I'm putting her in this box. Because she's so tall, I had to bend her legs to get her to sit down in the box, and I'm going to wrap her up with some tissue and some bubble wrap with a nice little thank you note. Um, here's the box I'm using. But we found her at a garage sale yesterday. Today is July 13th. So happy Friday the 13th, 2018. I found her at a local yard sale for only $5. Um, James actually found her for me. I kind of walked by her at first and he's like, well, what about this doll? And he showed me what he found on his phone about the My Twin dolls. And I'm like, yeah, okay, for five bucks, let's get it. And I brushed her hair out, took some nice pictures, put her up on eBay last night. She had three watchers within like an hour. And I had her for $40. She sold for the 40 bucks. Could I have gotten more for her? Probably, because these dolls sell anywhere from 30 to like 100 bucks, depending on condition, depending um, on the hair, if they come with an outfit, if they come with little shoes. And she has little white sneakers on. You know, cute doll. Hazel eyes, blonde hair. Um, so I thought it was a good flip. And she's going to a new home where someone's going to really love her and appreciate her. And uh, she won't end up in a landfill. So that's good. Bought her from a yard sale. Rescued her. And made some money off of the doll too. Um, these are some other dolls I bought recently. And they are called Ferga. Now last fall I sold two Ferga fashion model dolls for... Each one went between $230 to $270. I had them on auction. These are the, um, they called them old-fashioned. They are dressed like Victorian ladies from the 1800s, early 1900s. And this, I think this doll's about 17 inches tall, but if you see, look how pretty those eyes are. So I have her up on eBay right now for $99 or best offer. I found her at a flea market last um, weekend for $8. She's in beautiful condition. She comes with a stand, has little shoes too. And the brand of this doll is called Ferga, not Fergie, Ferga, F U R G A. Ferga dolls, and they're from Italy. Now, the Ferga baby dolls and some of the other kinds aren't as sought after, but the fashion Ferga dolls with the big, pretty eyes and the long lashes. Um, these go for more. Her, not as much. I have her at 60 or best offer. I mean, even if she sells for 30 bucks, I'm still making some money off of her because her outfit's in good shape. Her hair is cute. But yeah, if I had the Ferga model, like the Ferga 1960s mod looking fashion dolls, those go for some good money. So a little bit of doll, uh, bolo tips and tricks here. Um, what else did I sell? Let's see. Some perfume samples. I need to make a label for that. And these are doll. These are, I keep wanting to say dolls. They're not dolls. They're, they're little action figures. These are World War I era, um, like die cast metal, possibly lead soldiers. Uh, we bought these at an estate and we'll probably have more video about it later on, but I listed a lot of these last night and they have watchers and I put them in little boxes so they're kind of ready to ship. You know, we just need wrapped up. This is a nurse. So when I put like three and four together, you know, I put them in like separate little lots. So... I was working on that last night. I still have like cowboys and Indians to go through and sort out. But yeah, we'll probably do a video about those later on because we found some good stuff at this estate and it was a, uh, a family estate. So James will have more info about that. But 
Now you know what to look for for Ferga dolls. You don't really hear about them much, and um, they're very, very collectible dollies. Right, girls? The eyes are kind of creepy cool. Woo! Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye!